I'm going to show you how to do the bottom. This is a 10 blade. I'm going right up next to the vulva. All the dark. And right into the belly. A 10 blade won't cut the nipples. A 7 blade could. Right into the, uh, it's a hot spot kind of that adds moisture. And we lift this side comfortably. So with the grain right here, until you see your vulva and you've got all that hair. And inside. I'm going to switch and put a 7F on. And I've already done a little of this, but this is where I would just take it and feather it, where you bring it away. You can go against the grain if you want to blend it in with that pin. Stop, stop. This has already been done with a seven. Right around here is where I would use a pin. And then I would use the seven on the sides of her tail. You can scissor this if she's got a, a scar spot, so it's a little bit longer over that. Go backwards with a seven under the bottom of the tail. Just make sure that's cleaner than, it needs to be a little tidier than the top of the tail. When you go against the grain with a blade, you cut it half the length as when you're going with the blade. So I do the bottoms pretty much with the seven everything. I don't try to use a 10 in this area because going against the grain makes this look, makes this twice as close as going with the grain here. So if I go with the grain here and then I go against the grain, then I get that shorter look right there. It, for a show, we would use a 10 around here, and then we might use a 10 about a week before the show, but it's going to grow out to where the 7 blade would do it. So if I'm doing it right before a show, then I can do it with a 7 right now. And I could show her tomorrow with that, sh with that short bottom. Okay, that's good.